Thanks to the last week of Euros, there's been millions and millions, actually, probably I could say billions of coins flowing in FC Mobile. So we spent a ton to try to put together the best Liverpool team possible. All right, guys, so finally he sleeps here. Uh, let's take a look at this right now because this is where all these coins have been coming from. Uh, I've been buying and selling 90s for the last three, four weeks. Uh, usually pick up on Saturday about 290 rated players here from the events. And they've been on their low side. You've been able to pick them up for about 1.6 mil. So if we look here, see the, the chart down to 1.7 on like the 19th and 20th, which was last Saturday when I was purchasing all these, picked up about 290s in range and then started to sell them back once the events recycled and we started to see their value rise up to about 2.8, 2.9 mil, which is the highest the 90s have been since the beginning of euros they they dropped down into that sub 200 or sub 2 mil range and then went back up they've been fluctuating about 700,000 on a 5 day swing so if you buy 200 you know 200 players a week and you're making 630,000 a player on 200 players it's it's a good chunk of change that we've been kind of rolling through here lately but with the top 11 that was released and all of these awful awful sbc's where they're taking away all these players and the the last week of euros we've seen the 90s nearly triple in value which is crazy now this guy wasn't smart enough to hold out and uh i was unloading them at about 2.8 and was pumped holy shit 2.8 million is the highest i've seen them and, you know, you kind of get distracted. I wasn't online last week, so there I was slow rolling this in. And I'm like, check back 12 hours later. I'm like, oh, I still got some to sell. They're at 2.9 now. They're at 3.1 mil. I never saw a penny past 3 mil. Uh, and now they're at 4. So if this dumbass would have waited just a little bit longer... I could have really cashed in, but again, this was, I'm, I think about a billion coins in the last three to four weeks in just straight profit. And with that, I uh, decided what better to do than to, to work on the team. And there is a lot of money to get spent in this, um, specifically when, as we buy new players, this is kind of everyone's thing. As you buy new players, uh, you know, somebody comes out, you're looking at them in the market and you're like, well, I don't want to buy a base one because I don't want to throw a bunch of universal rank players in to train them. Maybe I'll go with like a fourth rank, third rank. And then you look at the values and you're like, oh my God, how much is it? Like if I go all the way, like how much do these things jump in value? So there's a lot of the players in the squad that I had that weren't quite at their top value. They weren't at their highest numbers. And I thought I've got all this money coming in because of this fluke shift in 90 value. Let's sell everybody that isn't at 30, sell everybody that isn't fully ranked and then buy back their fully ranked version. If we're ever going to do it, now's the time to do it. So this is as far as I know, and this is where I need you guys to step in. Am I missing somebody? Tell me in the comments. But as of right now, I feel like this is the highest level past and present Liverpool squad I can put together uh, using a full formation. There are a few players that could go in here. Um, I have some compromises I'm not willing to make. I will not swap out Milner he's in there until a better Milner comes along which isn't going to happen and uh don't ask me to put Lovren in over Kona it's not going to happen but this as far as everybody goes I think this is the best I can do I don't think there's any better wings or outside mids than Barnes uh even if you shift the formation and you go to a center defensive mid you know um Alonzo there's there's nobody that's higher 
than the value we're getting out of uh, Milner and Gerard currently. Now, my Gerard is not fully maxed. This, he is only at 25. Could take him to 30, but I didn't feel like there was a point in that if uh, I'm going to end up grabbing the higher rated Gerard here from Icon Chronicles within the next day or so. Uh, so if this one is here, actually it'll be tonight after reset. We should be able to claim the uh, max level Gerard, 98. So 98 will take him to 103. He is untradeable, but I've got all of these universal rank players that I'm not really using for anything. So we may as well do it. We'll get the throwback kit. We'll get uh, Gerard and swap him out. Sell the one I've got. Use a ton of universal rank players to take him to full tier at 103. But again, even at that, it's not enough to take this to 103. I just don't see a path to 103 on a full Liverpool squad. And this isn't even current players. This is past and present. If it was present only, there's, there's no way I could even get it this high. But if you guys see that I'm missing something, to get this theme squad as high as I can, let me know. Um... But this is, this is where it's at. It's been a fun week. A lot of coins shifting. Uh, selling like three rank and four rank players to buy their five rank version to, to not waste the universal rank players. That's it. That's all I've got. I just kind of wanted to put that out there and see if anybody has anything that I'm missing as far as uh, past Liverpool players. Wait a minute. You know what? Now that I'm thinking about that, I've said it out loud. Is there a Torres, an El Nino? Now that I'm thinking about it, I, I don't even know if I want to spend the money because isn't there uh, a better Torres here coming in Chapter 5 than anything we could see? So a 97? I don't know. Is Is there a better one look? What is the highest that's available? It's a 98 right now. So it's a 103. He's not going to be any better than the 103s that are in there. I could swap him out for Nunes. Darwin could go to Fernando Torres. That might be the only adjustment that I could make. see anything else let me know appreciate you guys hanging out um finally he sleeps make sure you subscribe here on the new fc mobile channel it is easy it is free it does make a big difference here on the channel so i appreciate you guys doing that uh as long as you guys keep showing up i'll keep making videos make sure you check out my other channels here on youtube as well raid Shadow Legends there in the first one. Gearheads, all things car related. That's my main channel on YouTube. And then for a few laughs, go to the old cringeworthy channel.